All right, so in this video, we are given this quadratic trig equation over here, both square x minus b cot x plus c equals to zero, and four of the solutions to this equation between zero and two pi are given over here, and we need to find the values of b and c that make these solutions true for this equation. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to draw out my solutions since it's quadratic, I'm going to have two sets of solutions over here. The first set is going to be pi over 6 and 7 pi over 6 because those both involve the acute angle of pi over 6. And the second set is going to be pi over 4 and pi pi. Oops, that's just pi over 4. And this one's five pi over 4, but the acute angle is pi over 4. So I know that coat is positive in these two quadrants for both of them over here. So I'm going to have positive solutions. I'm going to draw my triangle just in the first quadrant because that's all I need. So over here, opposite of pi over six using my special triangle is one, adjacent is root three and hypotenuse is two. And over here, opposite is one, adjacent is one and hypotenuse is root two. If I look over here, I can tell that coat of x, coat is adjacent over opposite, which is root 3 over 1. So coat of x is just root 3, because root 3 divided by 1 is just root 3. Over here, I can tell coat of x is adjacent over opposite. So coat of x equals to 1 divided by 1, which means coat of x just equals to 1. Now we need to convert this into this equation over here. So by doing our steps backwards, so what I'm doing is I'm going to move this coat x minus root three equals to zero. And over here, coat x minus one equals to zero. These are each of my factors. So if I multiply them out, coat x minus root three times coat x minus one and make this equal to zero. This is equivalent to this equation over here. I just have to expand this. So coat times coat is coat square x. Coat times negative one is negative coat x. Coat times negative root three is negative root three coat x. And negative root three times negative one is positive root three. Now, this is almost the same as this. The only difference here is we have a negative over here and we have a coat over here. So in order to make these two the same, I need to factor out a negative and I need to factor out a coat over here as well. So coat square x, if I factor out the negative, I'll be left with root uh, one plus root three. And then I'm also going to factor out the coat as well, but I'm going to write it after the bracket because that's how we like to format our equations. So I factor out a negative and a coat in this same step from the two middle terms, and I'm left with one plus root three. And then at the end, I just have plus root three equals zero. So now I can compare this equation to this equation over here. B is just, one plus a root three and C is just my final term there, which is root three. 